and we're back. Right, you might just have seen that, but uh, as I mentioned before, as I'm running around here, every now and again, I do bump into that, um, what do you mean it's locked? shouldn't be locked because we just did the thing with the man inside wait we gotta do this again there we go hidden man yeah so um every time I like come out of here so well I say every time sometimes the little girls are the little ghostly girl. She's not here this time, though. So, not sure what that's about. The door seems to be locked. Unless... We actually have to physically watch him through the hole and watch him leave. Me, yeah. Because it's doing the thing again. Okay. We shall play your game. We shall take the shot. And watch the man leave through the door. It's a bit odd that you've actually got to watch him exit the room. Now, can we go through the door, please? I would kind of appreciate it. Otherwise, there's some weird funky voodoo going on. Now we can open the door. Yeah. I mean, what kind of horse shit was that? Honestly. Okay, well, whatever. Get the Type 14. I did also find... Um, oh. The doomed girl. I mean, at least we got her that time. Ah, also... Did we? We did not spend our points. This is um, disappointing. There we go. Now we have spent our points. Excellent. Yeah, so not really sure what's going on with this Xbox. I'm wondering if the hard drive is just ever so slightly uh, loose. I might open it uh, later on and see because it did get sent here in shipping obviously right now <clears throat> I'm guessing we've got to go find the parts for the doll so if we do a 180 and start heading this way through this room there was I, I mean it wants us to find three different parts so, oh Where are you? Oh, shit. You're behind me. Get off me, you little bitch. I thought we was going to get attacked here. Because, um... Where is she? Oh, oh she's, she's like, disappearing. Like, she's hovering. Through the frickin' sky. Well, that's anus. Oh god. Oh hello. Get the fuck away from me. Please. I don't like you, love. Oh, she's behind us. No 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 get the fuck off me. Get the fuck off me. I am not a fan of this girl. I'm just gonna throw that out there. I do not like having to fight her in this area. I re ah, there she is. Add some of that. Huh? What do you think of that? You like that? You like that shit? That's right. Oh, she's over here now. Alright. We've got the good film loaded. Come to Papa. That's it. Oof. 
kind of... Oh, wait, what? But... Uh... Not really sure what happened there. Right, there she is. Yeah. Oh, there's two of them. Right. That's making a bit more... Bit more sense. Okay. Okay. Now we know what we're dealing with. There's two of these little bitches. And we might also want to seriously consider. Yeah, see, that doesn't seem to do an awful lot. When we hit them. Right, let's get some more health. Because man oh man, these little girls kind of hurt. Ah, one behind. Unless only one of these is real. Is that, oh, is that something that's happening here? Ooh. Let's give him one of those. Ooh, she's got a wiggle on. Get off me. Seriously. I mean, come on. Kids these days, man. Alright. Coming from that. Where are they? There you are. Right ahead. Oh, you bitch. Absolute bitch. Oh, God. The, the other one's coming right for me. Right, you're done. Alright, that should get significant. Oh! Wait. We only had to body bag one of them. Alright. Well, that's good. <laughs> kind of strange. So you only have to body bag one of the twins to get rid of both of them. That's fine. I can handle that. Kind of. Uh, right, let's go through this door. Now, is she going to be a constant pain in our arsehole? Because twin one is getting... Ooh. Twin one is getting sick of this shit. Oh, hello. Oh, right. So we've got to open the door. Let's use that. Ah, we got to wait for it to load. Come on, man. Charge that otherworldly goop. There we go. So that's... Something looks like a human head is on the ground where the girl was standing. Oh. Doll make a note one. A note fell from the lower part of the doll. It seems to be written by the doll maker. Uh, a cane has become a remaining. To comfort her, I'll make... A cane has become a remaining. Okay. To comfort her, I'll make a doll that looks like a zoomie. So, Azumi and a cane, I guess, were uh, two twins that were sacrificed. And I guess remaining means the remaining twin. The one that killed the other. She has been emotionless since the day of the ritual. I'll make a doll to look exactly like Azumi. So that when they are together, no one will be able to tell them apart. Kane never leaves Azumi's side, even for a second, always whispering things to her. I don't know what she says, but at least she seems to be slowly returning to her former self. If we didn't have this ritual, Azumi wouldn't have become a butterfly, and a cane wouldn't have lost her spirit. Well, yes. That is the trouble of this ritual of yours. So... We've got that one. Now. Where was the other... 
there was another chest upstairs I believe locks chest upstairs so I guess we're gonna have to go through here I'm trying to remember where all the bloody chests were now oh the ah oh shit isn't there supposed to be three of them three chests because it's the arms the eyes and the head I know where, well, I say I know where. I think I know where two of the locked chests are. I think. And there's another one that's upstairs. But as for... As for the third... Oh, hello. Ow, oh, really? We've already killed you once. But I guess in the interest of experience, I'm going to kill you again. Ooh, I didn't really get a huge amount of points for that, to be honest. Not convinced that's super worth it. She wants some more. A little bit of a basic core shot there. There she goes. Alright. Well, I mean, I'm happy to kill her again. If it means more experience. She's just going to keep falling, isn't she? Yeah. Come on. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Come on. So, if you miss that shot... She gets a free grab on you. Hmm. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. So, yeah. If you miss that shot, she kind of paralyzes you. And there's nothing you can do. That's a bit of a naughty mechanic. If you ask me. A very naughty mechanic. I don't like that. No, sir. I don't like that at all. Right, so we're going to give her one of those. Nice core shot. That should at least make her disappear. No. Yes. Yes. Right, okay. Oh, no, you see? You see? It just it didn't go off. It just didn't activate. Which is really bloody annoying. So we're wasting a lot of herbal medicines here. Right. Oh, we don't actually have to move there. That's interesting. So she just falls straight into our hands? That's actually really good to know. I reckon without too much difficulty, you could actually defeat her with the basic film. Not sure why she re uh, respawns though. I don't, uh, I don't remember any of the other ghosts. Ooh, respawning like that. Ooh, we can't save. And if we can't save... That means there's some ghosts about. Okay. So this is where the other one that I knew where it was. Which is fine. Something that looks like a human arm is on the ground where the girl was standing. Wait a minute. Right arm. Is there four chests that we need to find? Last night I heard footsteps. I thought it was uh, a cane, but it was actually Azumi walking by herself. A cane has spent so much time thinking of her sister, a spirit must have taken over the doll. Oh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I like that. It is said that when the spirit takes residence in a doll, it can steal the soul of others. 
A cane isn't a person anymore. She's like a doll controlled by Azumi. She keeps repeating, I don't want to kill, over and over. She looks so much like my daughter, Azumi. Must be killed. Again. Oh, that's good. That's really cool. I like it. Okay. Well, we have two of the parts. Now, we just need to find some more. And, uh, yep, I am going to keep saving this whenever I can because I really don't want this game to keep crashing on me. I have no idea what's changed. I have downloaded an Xbox emulator, but this game isn't compatible yet. So, let's keep exploring. Um, right. So we can't go through there. That door's locked. It's broken and it won't open. Oh! I wonder, down by the projection room, there was that little storehouse, wasn't there? I wonder if there's something in there. Let's have a little look. Because there was that storehouse that we could always get into, even in the beginning of the game. But... Um, yeah, the storeroom there. There's a projector. Sure. Let's go have a look. And that would be three of the parts. Right, I get so confused in this place. Like, seriously confused. Oh, look, there she is. See what I mean? She just randomly appears. That's uh, pretty good on the spooker scale, to be honest. I mean, like I say, it isn't my sort of horror. It doesn't do a huge amount for me. But I can appreciate what they try to do here. Was there a locked chest here? No. You would know if there was because there would be like a ghostly area. There'd be some funk. And there is no funk. Uh, Alright, let's head back down. It was this way, wasn't it? Yes. This is through the projection room. The projector is kind of an interesting idea, but eh, it could have been done better than it is. That's all I will say on the matter. Yeah, the heavy cloth sways in the wind. I wish we could actually like look through that. Yes, it had to be. Had to be. Right. So there's the left arm and the Violet Diary 3. You don't need a substitute for me. I am part of Arcane now. I am one with Arcane. Kill it. Kill that stupid doll. Oh. Right. So. Is that everything we need for the doll? Uh, let's go find out. Because I can't think of any other pieces that we need. We've got the head and the two arms. Now, well, ah, you know what? I know, I know, it sucks. I'm constantly saving it, but as I said, I'm pretty sure you guys can understand why. Not gonna keep having this fucking game crash on me. I do appreciate the fact that there are save spots everywhere. Okay. 
now let's go down and see if oh, looks like that woman's not coming back this time hmm now where was that doll's room in there so we need to go straight ahead I'm guessing we're gonna have to like fight her I don't know like one last time some like super standoff type of thing which would be fine kind of expect it okay to the doll room Didn't they mention that we need eyes, though? Or did I get that wrong? Inserted the... There we go. You put the doll together, but nothing happened. The note said that putting it all together should make it work, but... Hmm. Do we push the buttons? There are two buttons carved with family crests on the box-like structure behind the wall. Try pushing them, but nothing happens. Okay. They're all female Japanese dolls without a single male. Okay. Countless dolls have been set up to face the center of the room. They're all female, yeah, without a single male. All right. Ooh. Why did it make that sound? I guess we can't search that. Um, so what haven't we done yet? Because um, we've kind of been everywhere now, I think. I think we have. Well, let's head back to the safe spot because I think we're out of time. We rebuilt the bloody doll. But apparently something's still missing. Which I'm pretty sure I did read that it's the eyes. Okay. So anyway, I'm going to leave it here guys. When we come back, uh, I'm going to have a quick look and see what I can find. As I say, I'm, yeah, I'm pretty sure I know exactly what's wrong. Um, or should I, I say I know the component we're missing. I have no idea where it is or how to get it. But um, we will sort that out in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching guys. And as always, till next time.